She was released Thursday. The future of LGBT rights in Indiana remains uncertain after a legislative panel tasked with studying the issue says it's unlikely to make any recommendations. The panel heard testimony from people on both sides of the issue this week. Barbara Brozier was there and has more. It was the same debate. Society must step forward to show our trans loved ones that they are indeed valued and valuable. In a different venue. My rights and my privileges are not protected and are being eroded every day. After multiple bills aimed at providing some protections for LGBT Hoosiers failed earlier this year, a study committee heard more than two hours of testimony on the same issue this week. Members of the LGBT community, as well as allies and large Indiana businesses, urged legislators to adopt protections for sexual orientation and gender identity. As an Indiana headquartered company, we simply cannot rest until all who reside here in our home state have the same protections as everyone else. But others spoke out against equal protections for LGBT Hoosiers. Some say they're unnecessary, and others worry about how such legislation could impact public restrooms. They expressed fears that the law could put their children's safety at risk. My daughter, um, she's not comfortable uh, seeing the opposite sex organ on somebody in the same bathroom as her. The panel ended without legislators responding to the testimony or discussing any possible legislation that might be introduced when the session starts in January. Lawmakers have debated this issue for the past several years. Senator Travis Holdman says he was disappointed to see little of the debate around the issue changed since February, when many of the same people testified on the Senate floor. Nobody said, here's some middle ground, here's some compromise, we can, we can walk a path down the middle uh, between the two uh, sides on this issue. And uh, nobody came forward today uh, to offer that. I think everybody knew that would have to be, that's going to have to be the outcome. The panel could still make a recommendation to the legislature on how to move forward, but some committee members are hesitant. It'll come down to what, what the uh, committee wants right now at this point. Uh, I, I've spoken to several of them, they want to see what the courts do because they think that's worth going up, just like some other issues we've dealt with the last couple of years. The study committee will meet two more times but won't discuss LGBT rights. For Indiana News Desk, I'm Barbara Brozier. The committee chair says they have too many other issues on their agenda. And now,